What's up, gamers? We're getting into the story of uh, St. John Ackland. I'm going to throw some people around wrestling style. So before we get started, let's get started. You know what, St. Jim? <laughs> you owe me cuts from every fucking fight you've done for the last six months. Where's my money? Gone. To the families of the men I killed. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. If I should die, think only this of me. There is some corner of a foreign field that is forever England. Whoever wrote that was talking out of his arse. He obviously never had some screaming insurgent trying to blow his balls off with an AK. I didn't believe that patriotic bollocks when I joined the SAS, and I still don't now. Fighting was only another job. Nothing's changed. Except just about everything. attractive features and slender body deceiving you into thinking that I am of the female fucking persuasion? No, I don't think you look like a woman, boss. Thank God for small blessings. You'd be a right fucking moose. Shut it. Thank you, Charlie. I appreciate your vote of confidence in the debate over whether or not I prepare. But I was making a rhetorical observation. So get your fucking tongue out of me ass, because it's so far up there, it's tickling me tonsils. Yeah, boss. Now, the reason I ask is because you, Lord Ackland, seem to be intent on dropping me trousers and giving me your full two inches nightly in the ring. Now, you Larry the fucking lamb, it's enough to give me the arsehole. We had a deal, sunshine. You broke it. Unbreak it. I'll start winning again. Listen, my little Tony Blunt. It's my deal. And my rules. So you start playing by them, or I'll show you fucking broken. Go ahead. You think a great punts like you scares me? You just have to find another dog to run. <laughs> All right. Have it your way. Take a little trip and knock yourself out. But a word to the not very fucking wise. I know you think you're the dog's bollocks, but don't forget, I hold all the cards. 